I had a question for Mr. Hayes, actually. <coughs> um, your statements in the recent article on the Kelly case I felt was very premature, considering that you failed to mention that Kelly will be appealing his case. You also failed to mention the across-the-board victory on the Vince Lepore suit against the city and the Menachem Learning Institute. You also failed to mention that the court has ordered Mr. Lepore to take the Solomon Dweck deposition, of which you, the city, and city attorney, Aaron, Mr. Aaron, and Mayor Schneider will be subjects in their roles concerning the Ajmi Menachem Shabbat properties. Hopefully all that deposition, after that deposition, you and the others will now not be in a position to make such presumptuous statements as appeared in the press article. I made no such statement, ma'am. Uh, I can read it to you if you like. You can read it, but I didn't make any statement to anyone about the litigation, nor would I. I uh, it was in the Word of the Shore article. I'm sorry, ma'am? It was in the Word of the Shore article, and it says in quotes, Long Branch Business Administrator Kevin Hayes said that now that the litigation has been, quote, end quote, put to bed, he expects the litigation has been put to bed. He expects that Shabbat of the Shore will soon move forward on a mixed-use project that includes retail on the first floor, religious uses on the second and third floor in West End. That, that statement I made. Okay, well, it... The rest of the stuff is not in the head east. Well, it says it's in quotes. It's been well, then it's got to be true, Well, you are aware that of the of the, uh, the appeal and the Lepore suits not being... I wouldn't comment on any litigation, ma'am. I prefer okay. to see you turn. All right, I just like that on record. 